Welcome back to Minute Videos and our third episode of Thinking Fast and Slow. In our last episode, your System 1 hero instincts have kicked in, and you've taken this whole aliens taking over the world debacle into your own hands. Your acrobatic display of leaping somersaults has found you gathering the courage to enter the mothership. Unfortunately, all that physical exertion has taken away valuable resources from your ability to really think this whole thing out. How stupid of you. Of course you knew that high levels of physical activity can sharply decrease your ability to think coherently. Logically, playing it safe would have been the right choice. But the temptation to battle alien overlords was too much to resist. It's too late now. The ship is blasting off into the atmosphere, and this is when you enter the ship to discover that you have been surrounded by hideous eight-foot-tall green and purple aliens. They have what seems like an endless supply of arms, each holding a different type of weapon. Seems a little excessive. The hero thinks it's still bashing time, but this time you wisely choose to side with the scholar and go quietly. The aliens take you into custody and throw you into a force field cell. Not to beat a dead horse, but a little self-control earlier really could have prevented this situation. This inability to control yourself was caused by a phenomenon known as ego depletion. A high demand on System 2 requires a great deal of self-control and will, and after exerting that self-control on a task, like, say, holding back from karate chopping your ex, you tend to give in to temptation on the following task, like charging into action. But to your credit, you showed restraint in not karate chopping the giant aliens. Probably a good choice. So, now you're stuck in this force field, with ample time to reason out your escape, and practice a little self-control. Make use of that little scholar in your head. This isn't always easy for everyone. Studies have found that some people act more in line with the hero, impulsive and intuitive, while others more like the scholar, reasonable and cautious. Which path will you choose to save yourself and all of humanity? Your alien captors walk into the room and deactivate your force field barrier. They tell you to come with them. Thankfully, they speak English. How convenient. You realize that this could be the perfect time for an escape. You just have to carefully choose the exact right moment. Thank you for watching this Minute Videos episode on Ego Depletion. Stay with us when we attempt to escape our alien captors and discuss associative coherence in our next episode. Learning about the cognitive biases is all about perspective and seeing them in action. So please share your experiences in the comments, and don't forget to like and subscribe.